All right, so they're uh, 12 gram. Uh, so this is the less than lethal round, 68 caliber. Uh, we're gonna use these to break in here. Um, I'm thinking we can float these in a thickened, uh, a thickened accelerant. Um, so basically, we, it'll come with whatever it'll come with. But part of what it will come with would be a, 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 a you know, fuel thickener or whatever like that, or a, a, you know, whatever you want to put in there, liquid-wise, be a powder that goes into thickening it up. And I'm thinking, you know, can make it foam up. And I think if we float these, otherwise we'll just cut. I'm just gonna also gonna cut. Uh, I'm gonna give it a shot cutting. Um, like the finger off of like, a, like a, 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 a normal glove or whatever like that, a normal rubber glove, you know, like a disposable one, putting a little air in it. Basically, I don't want these sitting at the bottom. I need them, even if I've got uh, uh, flotation on them, so when they hit the ground, when it hits the ground, I need these to come down and, and, and fucking hit, to hit and, and crack the bottom, um, but not be so much, not be a threat during the, you know, the flight, normal flight process and everything like that. And I'm thinking about, I really want to float them. They're, they're heavy enough that I can get some reaction out of them, you know, once we hit the ground or whatever like that. And we'll be pressurized as well in here. Um, so, yeah, this is what we're looking for. Like, like you're looking at like 12.5 gram. Um, it's a PVC coating. I know it, it seems like it has a seam, but it technically doesn't have a seam or anything like that. It's used for less than lethal in 68 caliber paintball guns. Uh, but it's got a decent steel ball inside of it. Thank you.